Hi friends, I am Arun Giri. You are most welcome to our channel Technical Concept. So our today's topic is evaporation or factors affecting evaporation. So in this video, I will be explaining what is evaporation and which are the factors which affect evaporation rate. Okay. So if you have not subscribed my channel till now, the please subscribe the channel and also press the bell icon so that you will get notification of all my new video uploads ok so let's start our topic without wasting the time so first of all we will see what is evaporation evaporation is the process of substance in liquid state changing to a gaseous state due to increasing temperature or pressure ok this phenomena is very simple suppose this is a liquid when this liquid receives heat energy from the atmosphere and due to receiving heat energy this gets converted into vapor form so this phenomena is known as evaporation that means changing liquid state into vapor state due to atmospheric heat and pressure is called as evaporation this evaporation always happens at room temperature and room pressure ok then i will explain how this what is the phenomena of this evaporation how this evaporation occurs ok so suppose this is the water in a beaker this evaporation always occurs on the surface water this not uh, occurs on the uh, this uh, below water this always occurs uh, on the surface water ok so this water has some molecules the molecules which present on the surface of this water receives uh, energy from the atmosphere due to receiving energy from the atmosphere they becomes excited and converted into vapor form from the liquid form ok initially they are in the liquid form on the surface when they receive heat energy from the atmosphere and after receiving heat energy they gets converted into vapor form ok so this phenomena is known as evaporation when the energy of these molecules gets reduced then again come uh, gets converted into liquid form and this phenomena is known as condensation ok that means if energy reduced again and again they uh, converted into liquid then this phenomena is known as condensation ok and liquid which has low energy become remains liquid in liquid form in the water and molecules which receives high energy from the atmosphere they get converted into vapor and this phenomena is known as evaporation ok so this is how the evaporation occurs ok now I will explain you which are the factors which affect evaporation rate. The first uh, factor which affects evaporation rate is temperature. So our evaporation is directly proportional to temperature. That means if the temperature is high then a rate of evaporation is also high. If uh, temperature is low then rate of uh, evaporation will be low. Okay. So that means uh, we can see in hot summer the rate of evaporation is high due to high temperature whereas in winter season the temperature is low so due to low temperature in winter season evaporation rate is low ok now the next factor affecting evaporation is surface area ok for example you can consider these two beakers ok in this beaker one liter water kept and second beaker also we have kept one liter of water but the surface area of this uh, first beaker is less whereas the surface area of water in second beaker is more so this evaporation is directly proportional to surface area that means if water has more surface area then its evaporation rate will be high whereas water will have less surface area then its evaporation rate will be low so from the this criteria you can see that the evaporation rate of this 1 liter water will be more as compared to this 1 liter water. If the same water will uh, spread on the uh, ground, then its surface area will be more increased more and it will be it will have more evaporation rate as compared to this also. Okay, so our evaporation rate, is, uh, rate does not depend on the volume or quantity of water, it directly depends on the surface area of water because evaporation uh, takes place only on the surface it does not take uh, water which is present behind the below the surface ok now next factors affecting evaporation that is humidity 
सो इवोपरेशन इज इनवर्सली प्रोपोर्शनल टू ह्यूमिडिटी इफ आवर इन्वायरमेंट है हाई ह्यूमिडिटी देन आवर इवोपरेशन रेट विल बी लो एंड इफ एटमोसफियर हैज लेस ह्यूमिडिटी देन इवोपरेशन रेट विल बी हाई ओके सो दैट मीन्स आवर इवोपरेशन रेट इज इनवर्सली प्रोपोर्शनल टू ह्यूमिडिटी ओके नाउ नेक्स्ट फैक्टर इफेक्टिंग इवोपरेशन इज विंड स्पीड सो आवर इवोपरेशन रेट इज डायरेक्टली प्रोपोर्शनल टू विंड स्पीड If wind speed is more, then your operation rate will be high, and if a wind speed is less, then your operation rate will be less. Okay. So these are the factors which affect your operation. Okay. So I hope you like the video. If you like the video, then please press like button and subscribe the channel and share this video. And if you have any query, then please comment in the comment box. So thanks for watching. Bye bye.